So it's on the northern side of Rock Creek and just south of Tecumseh Road. So it's lifting a little more to the north. It's going to go over, over central and northern Max Westheimer Airport. It is on the ground in those neighborhoods right now. Probably an F1, Mark. Yeah, you're, you're looking at it right now, Mike. I've got debris lifting out toward me and past me now uh, on 36. We've got a lot of tree damage. I've got uh, debris blowing in toward the tornado. This is going to be uh, heading toward the water tower uh, on the north side of Rock Creek Power Flash, large power flashes. Uh, this fit, Mike, coming to the ground right now. Uh, this fit. Folks, you got to be ready for it. Mike's getting big. I got trees coming down on me in power flashes. I got to back out of here. I got trees coming down on me. Oh, wow. Back it out, Mike. Back it out. Mark Dillard is in at least an F1 tornado right now. It's uh, just to the south. It's, it's in North Norman right now. At least F1. Might be an F2. Power and let's go back to Mark Dillard's stream. He's, he's in the tornado right now in Norman. Go, Mark. Yeah. Yeah, power flashes. Uh, I've got power flashes in front of me. It is really cranking down, folks. I've got free damage. It is coming down right on top of us here. I'm just to the uh, north of uh, Rock Creek and uh, on, so on 36 here in, uh, in West Norman. Uh, got a lot of power flashes going toward the I-35 corridor now, uh, over toward the airport on the north side of uh, Max Westheimer. And it is a maelstrom out here, Mike. Whoa, hang on. It's back. Mike, uh, it is trying to move the car on me here. It is bad news. Yeah, you're uh, it's really you're definitely in it. Ground, it's going to cross I-35 at Tecumseh Road, and it's going to do so in about 15 to 20 seconds. Mark Diller, let's just hope he's safe here because he's actually in here about an F1, maybe a week F2. Uh, inside of it, these are, this is in North Norman. It's gone through the neighborhoods in North Norman. Obviously, there is damage, and he is actually in the tornado here itself uh, in his storm tracking vehicle. You're looking at it live here from on the west side of I-35 at uh, Tecumseh Road is where that vortex in about 15, 20, 30 seconds is going to cross Interstate 35 on the northern edge of Max Westheimer Airport, not too far south of the old York plant. Uh, so a little way south of South Moore. It's going through North Norman. Go, Mark Dillard. Yes, Mike. It is cranking down right now. I've had to. I've got a lot of debris. I'm going through the uh, Walmart uh, grocery parking lot now. I've got an immense amount of damage uh, just to uh, ancillary, uh, you know, buildings and signs. Uh, it is really cranking down, Mike. The RFD is tremendous on the back side of this thing as it is cranking down right now. I'm going uh, over on uh, Robinson. Now, uh, trying to get over to uh, I th or Rock Creek, rather, trying to get over to I-35. Now, uh, power flashes, and we've got uh, debris in the air, Mike. Uh, this is uh, wrapping up in rain very rapidly as well. Back to you. That. Here's Mark Dillard's stream live again. Tornado continues in Norman. It's in North Norman. It's about an F1, maybe a weak F2, and it, this is all still on the ground. Here's one side of it. The other side of it is right here, North Max Westheimer. It's crossing Interstate 35 literally right now. Power flashes. Mark Dillard's been in the tornado. He's still on the edge of it right now. Mark, tell us about it. Uh, yes, Mike. Got a little bit of damage to my vehicle here. Uh, it took off uh, basically the cover to the uh, rear view mirrors. Got a little close there, but it is really starting to crank down and get its act together again. And what I would call, uh, Mike, once again, a very, very large uh suction vortice area. The front side has suction vortices. The back side is now trying to crank down a separate funnel, possibly even a satellite, down on the back side here. This is bad news. Uh, on I'm at 24th Northwest in Rock Creek on the uh, very, very northwest side of the uh, Max Westheimer airfield. It's crossing uh, I-35 as we speak. So uh, just north of all this new development, there's that large uh, National Guard uh, armory uh, area there. And then uh, it's uh, 77 and, and flood wrapped back into I-35 and then the curve. So it's going to be south more, north Norman. This is it. You've got to take your tornado precautions right now. This is a large and violent tornado, Mike. Had a lot of uh, tree damage, high line, power line damage back there, and uh, an immense amount of uh, loose item damage like signage and whatnot. I didn't see, per se, uh, structural damage, but I didn't really have time to hang around and wait for it to hit something. Because it's cranking down right now.